Just a fast riff on the Barbie doll. Not that I'm some special expert on it. It can be criticized in all the ways people have about what effect it would have on the socialization of young girls. But what did Barbie not do? Okay, you talk about socialization. Other dolls were babies. So you're a young girl and you're trained to care for a baby and feed it. And isn't that socialization? You're going to have to care for little children and that's going to be your job. That's your, that's your role in society. Barbie was not a homemaker. They might, she might have had a baking dress, but most of them were not. Okay? Yeah, there was Ken, but Ken was mostly irrelevant in her life. Did she long to be married and settle down and have children? None of those outfits indicated this to me. I think of all these other ways one could have been socialized by that doll, and were not. It's curious that it received as much resistance as it did. I guess for the one case regarding its body type, and not for everything else that might have been a socializing force. How about the G.I. Joes? Why did I have dolls as a kid that were soldiers? Wasn't I being socialized to go to war? To kill people I've never met before? I played with toy guns, for goodness sake. That's how old I am. Where was the outrage at the time over that? Yeah, that, that's all I have to say about Barbie, G.I. Joe, Ken, childhood, and the forces that operate on us all, leaving us to have ideas and personalities that we think was genuinely formed within us. But at the end of the day, maybe they were imbued from outside of us, imbued within us from the outside by people who actually hold the strings to manipulate us into adulthood.